Um, we are going to a space theme science fair and it's very cool. It's by the graduate school students. So let's find Zach. Let's find Zach if he's here. All right, guys, watch this. It's gonna be a bit dark here. Okay. Let's go. Hello. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Hi. 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 Say hi. hi. Hello. Hi. hi. <laughs> This is the place that I'm just alive on it. Yeah. Start there. You can present. Just ask them to. Yeah. All right. Hi, Zach. Hi, hi, hi. Welcome to hashtag Space Odyssey, hashtag CM Open Day. Welcome to our postgraduate booth. I'm Zach, your host today. So here we have Kai and her lovely Vortex demonstration. So this is an engineering challenge. The question is how can we make the fluid move? from the top to the bottom in a quicker way. So here you can see it's just bubbling slowly. The engineering solution is to put a vortex in the, in the fluid like this, okay? That should be fine. You can see the vortex is, is established in the middle and now the air can easily travel from the bottom of the, the bottom chamber to the top. So the vortex acts like a straw and, and allows that to happen quickly. So now let's move over to our drinks, our bar, our very own uh, bar in here. You can come in. Sorry guys, can we make a bit of room for the TV camera? Okay. So here we have our guests at our bar. So you can come and buy these drinks here, only three ringgit. We've got our three specialties. Rakesh, what are they? Uh, these are Tokomatini, Plankton on the Beach, and the Kiwi Hito. What, what are they, they named after? Uh, Tokomatini is named after the Tokomak fusion reactor. That's the biggest fusion reactor till now we got. Plankton on the Beach is named after the plankton we see in Tucson Beach. Okay, it's a phenomenon. And the third one, Kiwi Hito, we completely dedicated it to Madam Curie. Okay, and who invented the radiation. Okay, so if you guys are wondering why it glows, it glows due to the quinine in tonic water. Uh, and uh, you can see the samples over here. Or if you guys want, I can just show you one. Okay, so here the drink goes. It's seven up. Seven up. Yes, the seven up. Non glowing, right? Yeah, it's non glowing. Glow. Then we add a ice. Okay. Still, it's non glowing. Still, it's not glowing. Here, the magic comes. See the magic happen. Okay. Cool, eh? Hey? Nice. So, okay, we can make it. More decorated for you people. Yes. Any Put a lemon on the yeah. head. For a camera lady. Okay, that's for the and camera a straw. lady. Can I drink it? Yeah, yeah, you yeah, drink, you it. drink it. Cheers, it's cheers. Edible. And halal. I love you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. How, how does it taste? Amazing. Amazing. It's really amazing. Okay, so now come over, guys. Let's see the um, the flower display and the gravity well. So you can explain. Oh, maybe you're yeah. Oh, you're shy. Okay. Okay, guys. So here we have a display showing how fluid is transported uh, in a plant. And it's something called capillary action. So basically, it's when adhesion is greater than cohesion. Adhesion is the attractive forces between dissimilar molecules. And cohesion is the attractive forces between similar molecules. All in all, it acts as a straw and the, and the stuff goes up. So here you can see our beautiful flowers. They've absorbed all of, the f all of the glowing water below them and they're glowing. So, okay, next up we have our gravity well. So, um, this is something that Einstein discovered, okay? So normally in normal space without gravity, things travel in a straight line like that, you see? Okay, but what Einstein found is that if you have a heavy mass like the sun it'll warp the fabric of space-time itself and so now when those same objects are moving through the field you can see they're influenced by the gravity of that object you see that cool right now onto the light mill so here you have the, the light from here is emitted and on the, on the mill itself, we have a dark side and a light side. So the dark side absorbs more heat and actually things have a, a, a force when they're hot. Okay, and last up we have this, this, um, this engine. Might take a while to run, but 
it's basically demonstrating the conversion of chemical energy into useful work. So let's see if we can get it to run. Ready? Normally it takes a while to heat up, but let's see, okay? Okay. So this is the point, we need, we need more time to get it energized and after that it could work. Yeah, I, I should have started it first, okay? Needs more time, but um, let's see if we can get it to work now. I really want to show this. Ah, it's hot. Okay, we still got time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think Almost we, out. We might move on to the next session. Okay, one last try? Uh, it was amazing. Thank you so much, Zach. There you go. It's working. Just about. Okay. Great, thank you. Thank you so much, Zach. It was amazing. And I loved it because and you can see everything is glory, even my, my lanyard. <laughs> Thank you Hashtag so Space Odyssey. Hey, don't forget about Hashtag that. Hashtag CM Open Day. Space does Space Odyssey Space and Odyssey. CM Open Day. CM Open Day. Catch in Malaysia Open Day. Thank you guys. Thank, Thank you so much. Yeah. Come visit our booth. Thank you. Okay, guys from this side. All right, guys. How was the Space Odyssey? So, I hope 